bacon and mushroom fusilli pasta. So I've got some mushrooms, some white uh, butter mushrooms there. I've got some bacon, that's back bacon that I've just chopped down or cut down into little uh, pieces. Butter, flour, penne pasta. And uh, mm, what else should I put in there? I might put a few herbs there. So maybe some flat leaf parsley a bit later on. But the first thing I want to do is, I want to get this bacon cooked down. So, uh, oil, uh, I've got the pan on, get the pan on some heat. A um, little bit of sunflower oil. There it is. Oh, there it is. Okay, that'll go in there. Now, I want to get this bacon really crispy because I want it really crispy in the in the, um, in the pasta. So, let's get the bacon in. This is going to take a few minutes. So I've got the bacon in there, it's in a hot pan. I'm gonna get this cooking down. It's gonna, probably gonna take about four or five minutes to get it really, really crispy. So we'll get it really crispy and then we'll come back. Right, so I've had the bacon on there cooking away now for about uh, about four minutes. As you can see, it's really, really crispy. So I'm, gonna, um, I'm just gonna drain some of the oil off. Let's come out of it. So, don't want all that in there. Okay, cool. We've got really, really crispy bacon. So what I'm gonna do now is, I'm gonna add about a tablespoon of butter in with the bacon. I've got some diced onions, we'll get in there. We'll get those cooking up. That little bit of bacon fat that I just um, drained off, I'm just gonna put a little bit in, not all of it. So we've got the bacon in there, really, really crispy. We've got the uh, onions in there. Now we're gonna put the mushrooms in. So, you see that? Ta -da. Cool. Pasta. Pasta's gonna take about eight minutes. So I'm gonna drop that in. City pasta. Get that in there now. Straight into salted boiling water. Right, just leave it, leave it, leave it alone so it cooks. Just leave it alone, it's gonna cook quicker. I keep stirring it. You know, well, not really cook it, just to move it slowly. Pasta, lovely. And so flour's ready to go in there. It's about one tablespoon of butter, so I'm gonna do about one and a half tablespoons of flour. Thicken it up. I've got 150 milliliters of milk. That's been warmed through for the sauce. Again, let's just try and leave it to cook. Right, and then I wanna finish it off. So we've got bacon, we've got mushroom. I'm gonna finish it off with some spring onion. So we've got some spring onion here. And we'll just put that off there, get that there. Do that at a slight angle. So. That I'll just use to finish off the pasta. See that? That's all cooking down beautifully. Bella, Bella, oh Bella. Okay, so now I want to add my flour. So one and a half tablespoons of plain flour. That's going to thicken the, thicken the sauce. So I'm just going to cook the flour out for a, couple, for a minute or so. And the flour then is soaked up all your all the butter. You see? So it's gone into like a little uh, 
a little thingy. Okay, cool. Now my milk. So that's about, I've prepared about half the milk. Now just give it a good stir until all the milk is, uh, so it forms like a paste. As you can see, it's good paste there. We just have the rest of the milk. And we're gonna cook it out. Let's cook that out. Let's cook it out. So I just really want to cook that flour out. I just want that taste of the flour in there. Okay, cool. And as you can see, it's again it's thickened up where the milk is, um, where it's all combined together. So what I would do is I'll just use a little bit of the pasta water. To uh, fill it down. Uh, what have I done with my um, ladle? Uh, have another one. So a little bit of the pasta water, it's quite thick now. A little bit of pasta water right in there. See that? It's coming to a nice, a nice sauce consistency. Oh. Beautiful. Right, let's give it a quick taste, see how it goes on. There's some salt in it. Table salt. So if we get some table salt in there. I've lost me salt. Where has it gone? Where has it gone? Where have I put those? It's all the baked beans. Okay, so we've got a bit of salt. Some salt in there. And I've also got about uh, a tablespoon of grated parmesan. I'm just going to drop some spring onions in. So now, it should be just about ready on the pasta. Give it, give it a quick, um, right. Come here. There we go. Gotcha. 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 Just almost cooked. Still al dente. Okay, so a little bit of that. Mm. Tiny bit more salt. Bring that flavour out. Turn off the heat. And the pasta's going to be ready now. So that's about eight minutes. Roughly. Um, so we're trying to pass it off and then straight into the sauce. Straight into the sauce, baby. You know what, baby? Baby, baby, baby. So sauce, pasta, straight into sauce. So this is my bacon and mushroom um, fusilli pasta. And then I'll just get um, put it into a bowl. So it's got a bowl there. And then we'll just, uh, just get that looking good in the bowl. Sexy, sexy pasta. Look 
And with that, yeah, with, so with that, with those quantities, that's, that is a really nice bowl. Good portion, or one, good, good one portion of pasta. So there's the pasta there. I'm just gonna drop a few spring onions over the top. So, more there, some more there, some more there, some more there, some more there. And a little bit of sheer parmesan. Around we go, around the pasta we go. So there we have, that is my bacon and mushroom creamy fusilli pasta. Just with a little bit of parmesan, a little bit of spring onion. Thank you.